Alrighty everyone, my name is Speaker89 and welcome back to Sea of Stars. Our last session we pretty much went ahead and went to the sky base um, in the Rise world. Um, and then from there we defeated the Catalyst. And finally, uh, we managed to go back to the clock Clockwork Castle uh, where we met with the Artificer, which is pretty cool. Um, in this session, we're going to be going back to the sky base and actually hacking into the Catalyst. And then we'll see how we go from there on out. Um, as we try and save Sarai's world, so um, I hope you guys will enjoy it. If you missed the previous episodes done for the series, check out our playlist on my YouTube channel if you haven't already. I consider subscribing to the channel to stay up to date on games such as this and any of the games we've moment. Alright. First, we have to make a, a full on trek back to the Sea of Stars. Dun, dun. on left over here. Let's travel to Sarai's world. Now we'll take the speedball to Sky Base. Probably should have maybe saved. That's okay. I've got a save point here anyway, so that's good. Um, I'm gonna need to use a different save file. Right on the marsh, that was a while ago. Come on, Artificer. Do your thing. I see. How about faking the, this packet? Good thinking, Spike. Now here. Too easy. This can't be it already. Let's try operating a door and we'll know. Oh, there's the other security layer. It'll take more, more than, more than that to stop us. How about this socket? On it. Credentials decrypted. Obvious fake. Obvious fakes. Hey, look at that. Oh yeah, blatant weakness. <laughs> Simple marshmallow, marsh, marshalling job, and. We're in. Now to disengage the cloud emitters. Hey, let's make it rain on the flesh man's castle while we're at it. <laughs> that will ruin, ruin his day. It will take a while for them to fully disperse. But let them. But let's make sure the ray, the first ray of sun hits just right. And done. Good work, everyone. those clouds. Ooh. Oh, now we'll be able to go down to the abyss where the moon is. I could feel my power surging. You did it, Artificer. Haha, <laughs> I'm the best. Hey, do the thing. Oh, right. Yes, I did it. Finally have a shot. Arty, thank you so much. Hey, don't mention it. It was the right thing to do. Plus it got us out of... Got us out of our prison. Well said, and well done. I feel strong enough to go after the Dweller of Dread now. How about you, Zale? Oh yeah. 
Time for a cleansing. Its lair is by the moon. You can sail close to it and dive down. Good luck with the, with the dweller. I've got more tinkering to do over here. Be safe. Alright, let's head back. Oh, I didn't mean. I was to cook. Not rest. Hardy stew. Might as well. Right, we'll make our way to yep the entrance. I think that's the closest closest area to the moon. over to there. I wonder how this fight's gonna be. It'll be very interesting going underwater again in a while. <laughs> That's pretty cool. <laughs> With the set. And we go. Dweller's here. I can feel it too. We've got your back. Oh, it will be an honor to assist you in a, in a cleansing. Dale? Yeah, it's coming. Oh, it's back to the normal music. It's back to like the, the original version of this song. Okay. to just go one at a time here. Far out. They're taking a lot of damage here. Let me just do Lunar Shield. Beautiful. Might as well just heal with the hardy shoe. Luckily I can attack after that. Oh, 
whoops. <laughs> I usually get more than than, than free there. <laughs> Timing was for some reason off there. Whoops, again. Try sooner, rang might as well. Oh, that did a whole lot of damage. Okay. This fight probably could have gone a lot faster. Plus, <laughs> doing damage here yeah, with the magic. That's okay. Still more. That was my bad. We'll just save them up and we'll do um solstice strike here ah, i didn't kill him that's okay i should oh now it's this song Doable? Yeah, it is doable. I was thinking it wasn't for some reason, but it is. There we go. Focus the damage on Dweller of Dread. Oh, we'll get that combo up. That's good damage there. Oh, Sarai's gone. Um, actually, you know what I'm gonna do? Switch to Rashan. I'm hoping I can ebb him. Fuck, I missed it. It took a little bit longer for him to launch. Oh god. Yeah, that killed Sarai in one shot. That's not good. Um... Guess we'll do the ultimate move then. Tentacles. I'm actually gonna go disorient him. And then we'll use uh, Rashan's heal. Okay. 
Strike, yeah. <laughs> I wasn't too sure exactly what I wanted to do there. The sun ball, the dash strike. There we go. Block. That's a lunar shield here. Good. Okay, that's enough for us to do X strike again. I might actually. Oh, it's not. I think it's better if, if I X strike with Zale. I don't know if that powers his like fire more. If I do that, maybe it does. Let's see. There we go, that was good damage. Got to disorient him. Look at the ultimate attack again. Ah, uh, might as well. <laughs> might as well do for layers again. damage there. Oh well, th this requires a disorient unfortunately. Oh, you've got to be joking. Oh, that's a bit annoying. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 I can still do this, I think. How much is our uh, Soriant? Seven. Okay, so. Mushroom Scramble on Sarai. There we go. And Disorient again. Beautiful. Almost got the free combo. I might, as I might actually just save it. I'll go... Moon Shiv. What else is there? It's probably other stuff. I'll just Lunar Shield here. Okay, Moon Shiv, and then Sail's got Arcane and Solar Magic multi hit. Oh, it hits one person. That's okay. Let's do it. Oh, right, it's this move. There we go. That was a lot. Just basic attack here. There you go. 
And we'll have um, Sayo do his ultimate. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Slightly this damage than the last time it hit. That's interesting. Okay. Oh, I managed to block that. Oh, God. Um. I only have two. I guess I have to do this then. There we go. I didn't know how much health he had left, so... Easier just to do that. There we go. Dweller of Dread is defeated. I can destroy that thing. Get it out of here. You did it. Ha! Ah, Belair, we just took down a Dweller. No, Eclipse. This power. I didn't doubt it for a moment that we could do it. Same, I feel so much stronger. That timing, that thing we did when Gaal was hit, it was hit by the curse. I feel like I can control it now. It's been growing within me too ever since. I think we are ready. The moon then. Together. Go get that bloody moon out of here. Get it up. <laughs> Unbelievable. Wow. are gone too. Yeah, destroy the sky base while you're while you're at it. <laughs> Teamwork, nothing like it. True power unleashed, Valer and Zael can now fly on the world map. Move along around with the left stick and press A to lift lift off or land on clear surfaces. You can also explore previously inaccessible areas. When you feel ready, the Flesh Mancer's castle awaits for the final confrontation. Oh, okay. Woo! Oh, and then you can Oh, that's interesting. Well, not necessarily done with this area just yet, um, because there is obviously something we have to do. And that is we can actually land on these bloody Solstice Shrine Islands. It's been too long. I do want to see if there's anything else that we can find before we, before we start landing. Anywhere else, yeah, so it looks like we just land wherever the hell we want now. That's cool. And on the sky base, just on the top of it. <laughs> Doesn't look like it.
This is cool. Right. What's that noise? Solstice Shrine. See what I'm, what's happening here. Yep. Go make that jump. Here you go. It opens that. all happy joy music now on. Might as well light up this place to see what we're doing here. Um, is this? What does that do? that okay so this one can't be moved at all this one one to my left it can but it can only be moved that far can't be moved outside of that. Um, I wonder if we can get rid of these like water blocks. I don't, I'm not too sure exactly what they are. Um, we can go over here. What does that do for us? That changed the layout. Oh, okay. I got rid of that. Not too sure exactly where I'm meant to be putting blocks in. Just moved it there. Just assuming that it could possibly go there. Not sure. Right. Um. Go from here. next but um why's that one not appearing anymore why is it I kind of wait is it determined by Oh, it's determined by where the blocks are. Okay, that's very interesting. So we want to go...
If this will work. No, it won't. This will, though. Like that. Pretty sure we can get to that, like, point here. Yep. Get up here. Nice. This will probably be the rest of the session, just me doing these, um, solstice shrines. Didn't think it would come to this, but here we are. Okay, so with that one, I'm pretty sure you can, like, pretty much just move. Because I can actually grapple to that point. I can do... I think I can just do that. Oh, actually... Wait, um... Might still work. Right, I can probably just do that. Yeah. Easy. Alright. And it gets to the chest. Or maybe not yet. Probably not yet. I need to go. Oh, if I jump here. Oh, um. Oh, okay. That's right. I need to move this like that. There we go. There we go. Beautiful. Boom. There we go. A third block has spawned. Now we can get to the middle. Back end of the, the dungeon. Now to figure out how to do this. Um... that one hit all of them have I unless the one unless there's not one for that one like that block there I'm not entirely sure well, that's not gonna work <laughs> not do anything with that um boom boom I think I could still make that work. Never mind. Oh, you know what I can do. Do that. That's gonna work. <laughs> that will work, one. That would that would definitely work. Yeah, see, there we go, there we go. Celestial Ray. An accessory. So that means two more Solstice Shrines up this. Okay, so what's Celestial Ray do? Magic attack plus five. Regular attacks regenerate one plus one MP. Oh the one that I have at the moment. 
plus 10 magic defense and its skills cost one. Minus one. Um. Cool. <laughs> Not too sure what to. I guess I'll get rid of the, the 10 like, defense. It's not that. Not gonna hurt us too much. At least I don't think it is. Alright. Now we'll go back to. Not the real world. Um, Valer and Zale's real world. Homeworld. Oh, I, don't want to, I don't want to do that. Landed in the volcano. <laughs> so, that would be great. Um, oh, there's that floating island that we can go to now. Pretty interesting. Okay, so there's the Watton Solstice Shrine there. Oh, it's like free, isn't there? Oops, I'm at the Skylands. Um, settlers, here we go. Solstice Shrine. It's good that there's a save point at every Solstice Shrine. Almost 30 hours into this game. Okay. Let's done that. There we go. Oh, okay. This, this is going to be this kind of puzzle. Interesting. Um, what does this do? Brain of the vine. And go down. Four of the buttons. So we need to hit two more. Turn this around. goes by so quickly. Um, I, I don't know why I'm like thinking that like I have to stay next to it in order to actually activate it, but I don't need that. Ugh. I think I need to drop down here and then they'll be able to drop. I think that's hitting it. There we go. Here. Here we go. I think I'm going on the tight rope here. Oh wait, I can get the button. Ah, uh, the, the lever. Sorry. What does that do for us? Oh, added an extra block. That's. Okay, that's actually quite helpful. Um, drop down then. There's another lever that we can pull as well. So that's number two. And we need to get to number three somehow. Oh, there we go. That's how you do it. Uh. Oh, but. There we go. <laughs> Had to move a little bit forward there, the blocks. I wasn't too sure if it was hitting it, but we got the right angle on it. Uh, hel Halatial? Halatial earrings? Is that Halatial? I don't even know. Seems like that's one more to go. Um, very interesting. Okay. 
Uh, what does that do for us? It's the... Oh, it's for the Zale. Sunball does full damage to splash targets. Oh, that's fine. Awesome. Might as well get rid of the power belt. Put that on. Celestial Ray exclusive to... Yeah, it's exclusive to um thing. Move on the next solstice shrine. There's one at Rafe Island. I think. Is this is this something from Wait, no it's not. That's not it. What's this? Ramaya's secret passage. Oh, okay. Uh maybe not there yet. <laughs> done this right oops excuse me lean down <laughs> it's also shrine I think I've done this one yeah I, I, I remember doing this this was yeah <laughs> we did it when we first came here I think Now to go to, yeah, that other saucer shrine here. Boom. Oops. Go. Okay. That's cool. I really like flying around. Um, oh, okay. Um, that's, we have to activate each of the different sigils on the, on the ground to open the door. There we go. Let's start off the, the lunar and then go whoop, wrap around to the solar. Oh, this is an interesting one. Said it? No. Did something. Yeah, I screwed it up. So now I can't move anywhere. Down. That, that's good that it can reset, so we need to like, move this way. I was able to jump there, but no. Um, okay, so we'll go up like that. There we go. Might as well light these up. 
Okay, full. Clips armor. That gonna be all the Solstice Warrior's ultimate protection. Fortunately, there's only for, only for one person though. <laughs> that's okay. Just chucking on Valer. That's all right. Is this even does this open any options for us to get like more rainbow conscious? I want to Now we have the ability to fly. I wonder if there's like any areas that we would be able to go to. Like, what? Well, I guess we'll see. It's probably so much more that we're getting locked now. Um, going to s no, not sleeper. What's even on the island? It's like a button. Hmm. And we're gonna wor we'll worry about that later. Um, we need to worry about the secret passage as well at some point. Okay. Um. trial. Um, entirely sure what's going to happen here. Oh yeah, yeah, here it is. I was like, I wasn't too sure exactly where this, um, whirlpool thing is. Like this little solstice shrine, like, residual thing. Lunala and Solon, you have come a long way on this journey. Weapons of great power have manifested in the dream world. Prove yourselves worthy and claim them as your own. Oh. This challenge is for the two of you alone. Are you ready to face me one last time? Yes. Close your eyes. All the mistrials. We might start with sail. Like a dash strike? Yeah, dash strike. Good, yeah. Oh, I'm starting to worry about that body. Elder Mist Sword. I'm 
should have healed first before doing this. Alright, that's fine. Um, oh wait, we don't have much healing. Um, that's not good. Souls to strike. There we go. Styles heal again. Nice. Got that mending light. There we go, sword's gone. For now at least. Uh you're gonna be joking, are ya? Is, is this a joke? <laughs> Can't do anything about this, can I? Um, no, I don't think I can. Maybe sooner rain will do like... Sooner rain will be enough, I reckon. Just like bring the power down, but I won't completely get rid of it, fortunately. reason not to. No reason not to do this move. Or any my ultimate move for that matter. Just, just send it. Salsa strike makes no sense here. Oh, the sword's back to life. Okay.
moon ring again. Okay. after this solstice strike. Boom. I don't know where my heels go. <laughs> Where'd they go, man? Might as well use Mending Light. <laughs> oh, sword's gone. No, we're just slamming. Slam a jam. Oh, God. Uh, well, I'm gonna have to take this damage then. Fortunately. Healing miss. Oh, I healed 140. Oh, you're gonna be choking. Don't do this to me. This is stupid. <laughs> this is. This kind of sucks. This does more. This does adds an extra attack to it. If not, I'm gonna be sad. But. No, I only took one. That's alright. Well, Blado. That's a shame. Um, I gotta have to just do the ultimate attack. Yep, salvation. Come on, sale. It's time. Even after all that, Jesus. Okay, Valer, you're back. You're back to doing this business again. I probably should have done sooner, right? But I'll just save it. It's good. Now we can do sooner, right? Oh, maybe not. Um. <laughs> okay, moon ring again. I think I can still do Moon Ring, a uh, Sooner Ring. I can do Solstice Strike right after it. Like, if it doesn't really matter too much, so let's do it. As long as I hit twice. There we go. Let's chuck the damage in. How much health does this guy have? Him, and now he's back again. Oh, that's good. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, mate. I just got a lunar shield. I think it's a heal. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, you've taken the piss here. You're absolutely taking the piss here. Oh, well, I'll just sunball then. Can we go one more mana point to play? Oh, this is interesting for Sarai. Um, sure, more magic defense. Chuck that to 100. Sean. It's interesting that, for, that Sarai didn't get any, like, didn't get a fourth one there. That was weird. Um, got more magic attack with Sean. Sets. We'll go with more health. And Zale. Uh, sh Whoa, more magic attack. Almost 100. Oh, oh, oh. Strong you are indeed. AD serve you well. Moonbow, Sunblade, Godspeed Lu Luana, and Solem. Legendary Staff of the Guardian Goddess Luana. Look at that damage. Legendary Sword of the Guardian God Solon. still go go and continue to do more stuff I reckon I'm stopping us I'll go ahead and uh, travel to the other bits I reckon the first thing we might want to do is I'm gonna set up camp first so I can rest up and get some more heal items. Oh wait, probably shouldn't rest up first. Uh, cook. I need to cook some stuff. Um, make three of these are uh, parfait. Then we'll make some. Really make two oh, the champions omelets. Unfortunately, can't make those. 
Um, it's the hardest shoe, isn't it? It's a good enough heal. And sure, we'll make some mushroom stew. Mushroom soup. Safe point. Boom, 30 hours. <laughs> and we'll rest up. Okay. Um I think we'll go to Ramaya's secret thing first. Maya's secret passage. Sealed by a mysterious force. Oh, it's changing the symbols. Um... Seen these symbols before? Hmm. Is there anything here? Maybe we have to go to Ramaya herself. You might actually have to... Go to Ramaya, maybe. I don't know. Okay, Ramaya won't be at the mansion. She'll be at... Yeah, over here. really matters um Sigils are referring to is anything. Mm -hmm. A little bit 
moment since we've been here. Are we gonna find anything here? Probably not. experience we got too. Dun, dun, Knock. There you go. That, that jump didn't make it. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, I guess it's a little bit higher. Um... Oh, it's a duke. I think his name is the duke. He was a duke, right? Yeah. Avantry. I don't mind the cold. I could only remember. We don't have anything for you, I don't think, so... What was this room? You look at that. <laughs> I remember this. I think I remember this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, it's so fucking weird that it's now come back to me to think. Oh my god. Okay, so we need a. F right, I'm gonna take a picture of this. So we need to now go back to Ramaya. Secret passage. Oh, that's interesting.
jump back up here. So those sigils, we have to pretty much um, input those sigils at the Ramaya place, the secret passage, so not too much of a, a trip. On, it's a little bit of a journey back, but um, it'll be okay. triangle that like upside down v1 the green change that around yeah so that's basically what it needs to be um, green one that's how it's meant to be red one is I think that's what it's meant to be like that and the purple one it's like Kind of like the opposite. Yes. There we go. It should open something. Ooh. This is going down to. Oh, up here. Oh, cool. Well, that that's good. Ah, oh, damn it, that's not. <laughs> that didn't kill. Are you serious? That's unbelievable. Beautiful. in the chest. Ramaya's journal. Hmm. We can give it to him. Yep. The journal. It seems like it belongs to the mistress. These entries have my hand have my handwriting. Ah yes, I have I had forgotten all about the estate. Basking in the summer sun and the flowers, they were beautiful. I wish I could go there again. I wish. Got yellow flame. Ferrymen will know what to do with that. Interesting. So now we've got a, like a different path that we can take with the ferryman. So, instead of that green flame that we've had pretty much for the whole game, from like a point where we got into this area, got a different flame to give to him, to hand out, present. Yellow flame you found, I see. Aboard my raft, I welcome thee. Half sunken tower. Oh, these guys got a lot more health now. We're in the right area. All 
Alright, power smash. Go. That was good. Uh, too much who we attacked. Just doing a basic attack there, got it. We should have saved this for another time, but it's alright. <laughs> Oh, maple syrup. Oh, yeah. I'm done with this area. This part, at least. Oh, we can rest here. Save as well. That's probably a good thing to do. That we went that way. Oh, enemies above. Resist the magic. Punch it all it takes. Oh, I see what's happening here. We have to drop down to the bottom. Six peaches. Ah, oh, of course, there's some other enemies. 
Boss. Oh, the bubble. Shit. I'm gonna switch to Rashawn. Oh, actually. No, we have this set. Switch to Rashawn. And he'll do that heal. Yep. Here you go. So, Saul. Oh, he's gone. That's alright. One less enemy to worry about. Oh, two less enemies to worry about. There we go. It's like four current of time. Jump. Two obsidian ore. Where is this leading us to? Oh god. Oh, it's Ramaya. Um, that's interesting. I'm gonna use Zale's heals. You again? How did you find this place? You're keeping Duke Advantry in this world against his will. We're ending this. Oh no you don't. Don't what? You don't steal my journal and barge in here making demands. The magic object keeping him tethered, where is it? The locket is mine and mine alone. So it's a locket. The nerve. <laughs> the coarse sense, coarseness. Not again. Have you met her before? She doesn't seem to like you very much. Enough. This will be no mercy for you this time. There'll be no mercy for you this time. You will pay with your life. Prepare yourselves. Necromancy. <laughs> I just... Oh wait, oh, uh, Sarai. Yeah. I was like, who's able to deal with that? There you go. Bone piles. Bone and flesh pile. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's interesting.
Oh, there's a bone pillar I have to deal with first, and then I have to get Ramaya. Can't hit Ramaya now. Shit, okay. Unless it counts as the bone pillar. Not sure. Let's see. No, it didn't. Sinnering. Let's do it. I was hoping that was attacking Ramaya there. Oh, fuck off. Okay, that's all right. That's a bit annoying. <laughs> oh, that's that's shit. That was my fault. <laughs> Ultimate move here. Switch to Rashan here. I'm hoping I can get the hit here. There we go. That's all I wanted. Next. 
Or X Strike. Oh. These boss fights, man. Ah, oh, that's a bit shit. Oh, that's. <laughs> I should have um, disoriented him. Yeah, I don't know why I can do that. I have to take out this bloody remnant. Remnant. <laughs> just gotta summon whatever is at the flesh file, so might as well just bring that below down and just deal with whatever's gonna come out from here. It's the Lonson. Might as well just Lunar Shield here. everyone. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to. <laughs> Go. Sooner ring again. All targets to hit, but there we go. I'm actually just going to do the ultimate move here. as well. Shard time. Ah, oh, crap. Um, not yet. Oh, never mind. Uh, that's not good. This only does poison, and that's it. No poison, um... Oh wait, there we go. Oh, 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 loop. There we go. That's gonna help. That's that helps out. Fucking hell. That's good. I got that. Here we go. Here we go. Infinite loop. Beautiful. Oh 
health, much more health does she have here? Unbelievable. I might as well disorient her. Why not? There we go. Sarai with the spinning slice. Wait, wait. I... I yield. Well fought, my lady. Don't you start. It's okay, Ramaya. Just give us the locket and we'll be on our... We'll be on our way. Insolent fools. With their powers, they don't earn barging in here foiling my plans. Here's your locket. Now leave. Avantry locket. I tell Duke Avantry that he's fired. Understood? He's not quitting. He's fired. My lady, why are you so angry all the time? You know, in my village, the set, forget it. Excuse me? Who do you think you are? Let's just, get, let's just go, okay? Yeah, time to leave. <laughs> Holy. Let's see if there's like anything else. Anything here? Oh, rainbow. There's a rainbow clutch down there. Oh, here we go. Wow. That's a good find. I was <laughs> kind of had a feeling that there might have been something here as well, like a rainbow clutch. Only got a couple left, so. Here we go. Alright, now let's take that to Duke. We'll tell him the news that he's fired. Best news yet. Probably the best news that you'll ever hear. Shit. <laughs> Wrong place to jump down to. Locket you got. To the Duke, I shall take you lot. <laughs> oh. 
whoops, that's the that's the wrong area. Didn't mean to drop down. I have to go the whole way around. We'll leave that like floating island for, for the next session I reckon. Probably won't be, will be too much to do. <laughs> There'll probably be a lot more we have to do in that like regard. Um, probably something, another like secret thing. Probably another rainbow conch that we'll be able to get to most likely so. Still up here. He's moved. If he's moved over here. Um Where'd he go? Where has he gone? Of stuff. Oh, wait, I need to. I need to go this way. Yeah. <laughs> need to jump up here. I reckon he might be where we first met him. There was a like he didn't like move into a different like spot after, a, after the first time we met him. I think like over here. We should be over here or something. Ooh. Time to fight these enemies. There he is. That's where we first met him. I'm pretty sure. Lock it. El Wil El For you to be the one who saves me in the end. How poetic. Thank you for your help, brave souls. Please accept this key to my coffin. Its contents belonged to an old rival of mine. I believe it will be of value to you. Oh. Farewell. over here isn't it we can open this now eclipse armor advantage crest solstice warriors ultimate protection ah okay so that's where you get the other one I was wondering I was wondering where you can get the second one we got it all right so I reckon to finish off, I reckon we'll go ahead and um, listen to that story. Actually, we have to get out of here. Uh, green flag. Set up camp here. Talk to Teeks. And a new artifact. Let's see here. Paradise Lost. 
house. I would like to hear the story. Oh. Sorry about that. <laughs> Paradise Lost. Let's read it. A wilder was a fair leader who cared not for the titles. Stories say that she spent equal time at Avantry Manor as she did in town with her people. Under her reign, the Chent, or Lucent, I don't even know how you pronounce it, uh, knows new prosperity and upheld its title as Bastion of Light like never before. By her side was Duke Avantry, proud noble and fierce defender of his land and people. Never Star Wall fought. Yes, Star Wall fought. It is said that the flame of his dedication to the Chet burnt only cooler than that of his fiery love for a wielder. Despite the looming threat of the Clockwork Castle, they managed to keep their people safe, happy, and hopeful. One night during a long journey of broad, like so many others, Duke of Antri woke was awoken by the emissary carrying urgent orders. The wilder demanded that he return to Le Chant at Wath at once, offering no explanation beyond hinting at some dire threat. When the Duke arrived, he was greeted by a raging firestorm. A sizable portion, a sizable portion of the land was burning, but there was no enemy forces in sight. Solemn, a sun solstice warrior had turned to evil. Hiding somewhere on the island, he would come out once and once a day to dis deplete his power, slowly burning away at the landscape. Thanks to the trial of conflagration, or conflagration, have an interesting word there. He was easily tracked. Their flight, their fight persisted for days on end. But for all his might, Duke of Antri was unable to defeat the evil Solstice Warrior. Seeing the collateral damage caused by their battle, he accepted they were at a stalemate and retreated, in order to avoid further destruction of his already bleeding land. Struck by despair in the face of his inability to protect his people, Duke of Antri left his guard down and in walked, and in walked the enemy. Fleshmancer Alkalite II approached in disguise and offered him a magic shard. This ancient shard was made by the Ovates themselves, she lied, fully aware of Duke of Antri's weakened state of, of mind. It will, shrouded, it will shroud your island in complete darkness for one day, blocking all light from sun and moon. My enemy's power would be muse, but playing to Duke Avantri's sense of honour, who gave him the final nudge. Solstice Warrior hadn't been playing by the rules either. Surely you wish to protect your people, she asked. Duke Avantri accepted the shard and thanked her for her help. Simply smash the shard with conviction and its magic will awaken, Two explained on her way out. He wasted no time in smashing the shard by voluntarily activating the curse his island lay right into the acolyte's hands. Everything went fine at first. The, the night shroud covered covered the land, and Duke of Antri made short work of the weakened Solstice Warrior. As celebrations began, they put out the call for wind mages to gather waves strong enough to flood the eastern part of the island. The flames were extinguished at last, but in doing so, those areas were transformed into the famous swamps we know to get today. It was a change welcomed by all. For it came <clears throat> for it came hand in hand with the night shroud. It took a few weeks until it became clear that all the night shroud would never succeed. Despite overwhelming support for, from his people, Duke of Antri could not forgive himself for his mistake, finally realizing who had really given him the magic shard and parted for the clockwork palace. On that day, Duke of Antri played into the Acolyte's hand for the second time. While he was away, Fleshmancer Flesh Acolyte III 
traded a voluntary manner and killed a wilder. Thus the, was the ritual completed and the seed of evil was planted in the mansion, which a few centuries later would grow into the dweller of woe. Oh. Completely defeated over the following days, Duke of Antri died of sadness and despair. As if fate hadn't been cruel enough, over 200 years later, Ramaya found his urn and raised him from the dead to be a bodyguard. For decades the Duke roamed the swamps he once ruled over, his memory completely gone, feeling nothing to save, save for an unexplainable sadness. In bouts of clarity, he would feel a brief of very deep yearning for something he couldn't put his finger on. Such was the Duke's plot for half a century until one day young Solstice Warriors reclaimed a wilder's locket and brought it to him. His memory now restored, Duke of Antri smashed the locket and in doing so broke the tether binding his soul to the material plane. At long last, he found peace and was free to leave his world. Alright. Montreal has gone through a lot for the many centuries it existed, so that's gonna do it for me uh, for this session. Sea of Stars. Next session, we'll go ahead and travel to that floating island that exists um, in the home world. And I think from there, we'll see how we go um, as we continue on with the main story and hopefully defeat the Flesh Monster. So. That's going to do it for me. Thank you everyone so much for watching this. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you missed the previous episodes of the series, check it out my playlist on the right side of the screen. On the left side of the screen, a playlist of other games from the past currently playing at the moment. So if you're interested in seeing those, check them out as well. And in the middle, you can go and subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on games such as this and any of the games at the moment. Thanks once again everyone so much for watching this. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys next time.